Hello, my name is Matthew Cotto, and I'm sitting here with Miss Carrie Distance, who is a Baltimore native. And I was just wondering about Baltimore. A lot of people have a lot of different views on the city of Baltimore. So in your opinion, can you tell me about your experiences growing up in Baltimore and being from Baltimore? Well, I personally love being from Baltimore. Um, growing up, I can remember my family going to cultural events and festivals and things of that nature. Um, as well as growing up playing what you would call probably now old school games because um, kids don't really play it that much anymore. Um, so I would say I had a really good experience growing up in Baltimore. Um, although I was able to mingle with different races and things of that nature, I've also experienced things involving racism um, and discrimination based on disabilities. Okay. I personally don't have a disability, but I have a brother with a disability, and I can recall a situation when um, my family and I, we went to car racing, and a white man did attack my brother for accidentally bumping his son's car, and it escalated into a situation that it really didn't have to. Um, I recall situations that as well, as well as um, positive that have grown up for. <laughs> Can you elaborate because you're from New Jersey mm -hmm. on a different one and telling me to know the death of slave owners and whips and whistling to get rid of all the bullets and shit to death? I think just when we ask the question, I think people are raised and don't cry too often. Oh, bad. Like in my way, yes. my mother was black and her mother was saying, and it was hard. And we call her she was cut on things like that was tea and pasta and wine. What's the main city and the main right word at the time? Like a circle rotate within the same distance.